वेलकम टू द फिफ्थ वीडियो ऑफ पेंटाओ डेटा इंटीग्रेशन सो हेयर इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू क्लोन रोज इट्स अ बेसिक एग्जाम्पल जस्ट इट डेमोन्स्ट्रेट यू हाउ टू क्लोन द नंबर ऑफ रोज विच इज कमिंग इन योर इनपुट फाइव सो लेट मी क्रिएट अ रेंडम स्ट्रिंग्स फॉर यू रेंडम रोज बेसिकली सो आई हैव टेकन Uh, one field as description and another as trans uh, transaction date both uh, types are string and date and i have created five rows let me preview and show you uh, you can see a, a string over here in the description all the same strings are repeated in the five line and all the same dates are coming in the transaction date so next is i have created an id for each and each row so here if you see in my last video there is uh, i have show you demonstrate on id sequence generator so you can see i have created uh, sequence number for each row so here it comes to 1 to 5 next here comes the clone row which is demonstrate in this tutorial so let me open this what it is doing is its name is uh, mentioned here clone rows you can name anything which you want in the transformation that should sh suits on your transformation so in the next line its number clones it shows how many number of clones you want to generate let us say i have create two for this particular uh, transformation and if you want to generate clones based on the input field from the previous step so you can click on this check box once you click on this check box previous uh, dialog box is disabled it means you are taking number of clones field from your input field step uh, next output field how output fields are showing in the tab so here add clone flag to output if you want to add a flag in your output uh, in your output then you need to add a flag field with a name here i have given flag <coughs> then add clone number to output if you want to generate number in the output field like i have mentioned number of clones as 2 so in my initial in my previous step five rows is coming and i have created two for each rows so that comes around 3 into 5 that is 15 okay 0 1 2 3 basically so i have created here add clone flag to the output clone flag field that is flag and add clone number to the add clone number to clone number field so i can here put as flag number no that's number of rows for each clone okay let me show preview for you quick launch it is giving me error let me check and debug the error for you you can also also go and check the error field contain the clone numbers are missing okay let me check mm. okay let me first show you add clone flag to the output clone flag field is name as flag so basically i'm going to show you how you can give the data again clone field contain the clone numbers is missing okay so here i have uh, checked uh, in this check box which i need to remove now number of clones basically the error is coming due to i have checked this box and i have not put any field name in this box and also this is disabled so this is the reason for both uh, both the errors and now add clone flag to the output so i have added flag here and add clone number to the uh, to the field like it is giving me in this particular case 0 1 2 0 1 2 Zero one two like this. 
and with the na field name as number of rows. Let me go and preview for you. Again, it is giving me error. Let me check. Field number clone is missing. Particular case. Okay, I've just missed. Sorry. So here, let me okay. And let me show preview for you. Now you can see two fields are generated, which is coming from my output field. One is flag, and another one is number of rows. So here, as you see, initially we have taken uh, five rows like this, 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 and this. So these five rows I have created, and I have taken clone of each row two times, as I defined in the transformation clone transformation step so here you can see 0 1 2 0 1 2 0 is the original step which is coming from the input field and 1 2 is the clone copy of this so you can see flag like the rows which are generated by this step is coming as yes 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 and yes and here number of rows is coming so you can get this understanding basically from this transformation let me know if you are having uh, any further doubts for this okay then that's fine from my side uh, hope you find this video informative and uh, uh, let's wait for the next video then thank you